Look at this, it's snowing. Oh, this is the weather that I wanted for my last video. What's up guys, how you doing? Thank you very much for checking out the video and welcome back to Colocraft Bushcraft. Uh, if this is your first time here, my name's Alex and this channel is all about my journey trying to learn and develop bushcraft skills. Uh, today's video, um, I'll be honest with you, I don't have a plan. Uh, half an hour ago, uh, it was not snowing uh, and all of a sudden it started coming down so I have quite literally just grabbed my camera, grabbed my backpack with a like, minimal amount of stuff in it and just legged it down to my camp because I really, really didn't want to miss the snow. Um, it is five to ten now. Um, as I said, half an hour ago, it wasn't snowing at all. Now it's really coming down, but um, according to the forecast, it's only gonna snow for about two hours, and then it's gonna rain for the whole of the afternoon and, uh, and into this evening. So I don't imagine that this snow is gonna last long, so I really wanted to, uh, to get out while I could. Uh, so I don't really have a plan uh, for coming down here. <laughs> as I say, I've just grabbed a bunch of stuff and legged it down. Um, I think what I'm probably going to do actually is, because uh, I've got my gas burner with me, I'm just going to uh, sit, relax, enjoy the snow, um, have a coffee uh, and just enjoy being out here and watching the uh, watching the snowflakes fall down for a little bit because it is, it is amazing. So I'm sorry if this video isn't more interesting than that, but the weather's just amazing and in, in southern England where I am, we don't get this very often. So, so there we are. Anyway, camera's getting covered in snow so I need to uh, get that under a bit of cover. Um, I hope you enjoy. I've had to put my uh, sit pad over the camera to try and um, protect it a little bit from the snow. Um, I could have put a tarp up, but I kind of, given how nice the weather is, I don't really want to put a tarp up. Uh, I'd rather just kind of enjoy the snow. So I'm currently sitting on my tarp, uh, because as I say, my sit pad's on top of the, <laughs> on top of the camera. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna sit here and relax and uh, wait for my water to boil and then have a coffee. I'm hoping there's enough gas left in my canister to boil the water, I don't actually know. It didn't seem overly full when I turned it on, so fingers crossed. But yeah, beauty. Oh, love it when it snows.
don't know what those car sounds are, but it's really annoying. <laughs> I don't know how heat proof these gloves are, so I'm really trying to handle the billy can as little as possible. Whoa. Instantly turning the snow into ice underneath the cup, so it's sliding everywhere. Beauty. Or just throw it over, that'll do, right? Pop you in there. <laughs> Cheers, guys. It's just coffee, by the way. There's nothing exciting in it, unfortunately. I didn't have any beer to bring down with me because it's, well, my watch stop. Oh no, that's fine. Half past ten now, so a bit early for a molly drinks. I'm going to How are you guys all doing with lockdown? Such a pain. I just want to reassure everybody that where I am right now, it is completely and utterly lockdown safe. I've not broken any rules at all by coming here. Um, the only reason I say that is I have had a couple of comments um, recently uh, when I uh, was promoting my latest video on Reddit, I think it was. Um, I had a couple of people going, oh, you're breaking lockdown rules, you're a bad person, oh, you're so selfish, and all that kind of stuff. Um, I'm not breaking any lockdown rules at all by coming here. I don't have to travel. Um, this is literally on my doorstep, so everyone can relax. I'm not breaking any rules by being here at all, and I am completely and utterly isolated, so I just wanted to um, reassure everybody of that. Um, but yeah, lockdown, man ready for it to be over. I'm sorry that all of my videos recently have been coming from camp but that is quite literally because it is the only place that I can safely and, and kind of legally if you like um, come and do anything. You know I would have loved to have been able to go out and do trips and overnighters and, and do stuff like that like I really want to do more canoe trips and and more hikes and tramps around Dartmoor and stuff like that but I just obviously can't do it so for the time being I'm afraid you're just gonna have to put up with uh, with camp videos. Uh, but when it's like this, when it snows and it's a bit different, you know, I don't think that's a, a bad thing by any means. Um, you know, seeing the snow coming down and then being able to just grab, literally grab my gear and run down to camp was... It, it's ab absolutely brilliant for me, so... Yeah, I hope you guys understand. I'm sure you do. Mm. Ah, coffee's good. I've got a new job! I've got a new job, I forgot to, uh, I forgot to mention that. Couple of, uh, a couple of videos ago. Um, for those of you that have watched the channel since the beginning, you'll have known that I left my last position e at the end of January, so this time um, last year. Uh, it was all voluntary, I didn't get fired or anything like that. Um, and I've been, looking, I've been looking for a new role kind of in, in outdoor activity, instructorship, that kind of thing, um, or a bushcraft instructor's role or something like that. Um, and then of course COVID happened in 
you know, March kind of time last year. So everything kind of got shut down throughout the summer. So there wasn't really a huge amount of possibilities out there. But um, over the last few months, I have um, managed to secure uh, a new position um, as an apprentice uh, outdoor instructor. So I'm really looking forward to starting that. That will start in March, fingers crossed, hopefully with all of the, you know, the vaccine rollout and stuff that's happening, hopefully by then the COVID thing may be easing off slightly so that this summer we can get back to some kind of resemblance of normality. So as I say, so I've got a new job. Um, I'm really looking forward to it. It's, um, it's with a company that have, uh, that have centers all over the country and I think they've even got one in France. Um, it's a 14 month contract, which I'm really looking forward to. And by the end of it, I will have all kinds of certifications and qualifications in, in various different outdoor um, activities. Things like archery and, and paddle boarding and canoeing and stuff like that. So um, it really, really should uh, add a whole load of arrows to my quiver, as it were. So I'm looking forward to starting that. Um, God, I hope COVID doesn't get in the way too much because, you know, I've been without an official job now for, well, a year, effectively. And I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready to go back to work. Uh, doing something that I love. I'm not just going to take any old job. Um, that would kind of defy the point of me leaving my last role. So, as I say, uh, I'm really looking forward to it, really excited, and, and um, I can't wait to get going. Mm. It does mean that the regularity of my videos might become a little bit sporadic. Um, you know, the where I'm going to be working is probably... 50 miles or so from where I live, so I'm going to be driving every day. Um, because of the type of work it is, I don't. I'm not going to have like a set schedule. Like I'm not going to have two definite days off a week when I'm going to be able to get out and do bushcrafty stuff. And it's also because it's an apprenticeship, there will be a, a certain amount of, uh, I guess, kind of classroom learning uh, and that kind of thing as well uh, that I'll need to be doing in my time off. So I will most certainly keep putting out videos. Um, you can, you know, rest assured that I'm not going to stop doing this just because I've got a new job. Um, but I don't know for certain that I'll be able to put out videos every week. I'll certainly try. Um, as I say, I'll still have some time off during every week, so I should be able to put some videos out. Um, I just don't know how regular they'll be, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it anyway. Alright guys, so my coffee's done, um, so I think I'm going to wrap this video up here. Um, thank you very much for watching guys, I'm sorry it was a little bit sporadic um, and random. As I say, I really didn't have a plan um, when I came out here, it was very much a case of OH MY GOD IT'S SNOWING! Grab the gear, leg it down, and then get here and go, oh, need to film something. So anyway, so thank you very much guys, I really do hope you enjoyed it. Um, <coughs> As always, if you're new uh, and you enjoyed this stuff and you like the kind of thing that I'm doing, make sure you hit subscribe, hit the bell to stay notified. Go and follow me on Instagram if you if you do that kind of thing because I post stuff on there as well. Um, and I shall see you very, very soon in another video. Take care, guys. See you soon.